Hi, I'm Jimmy Clues and welcome to my new wood turning DVD. The first project on it is this beautiful spalted burr birch ball. It's really unusual in, in the size of the piece of wood and the main thing that I wanted to do with this is to explain to you how to use the ball gouge. I get many, many guys, as I said earlier, asking, you know, they, they want to know how to improve the wood turning techniques, the tooling techniques, they want to, they want to avoid scraping so much, they don't want to do so much sanding. And uh, I go in, in a lot more detail in this DVD than I did on the original one, Turnaround, in that, um, that we've got some excellent camera shots and you can see exactly how the tools are working. Um, the second project is the, uh, the oriental style lidded box. This in particular is a really nice job because you've got a number of mounting techniques. Uh, the tooling techniques are exactly the same as, the, as, I, would, uh, as I would use on the ball. Um, but I've also added the introduction of how to use uh, 24 karat gold leaf as, a, as an embellishment. And uh, also we actually start turning from a rectangular piece of wood. Um, I'm sure you'll find this one, this one quite interesting and uh, I hope you enjoy the rest of the DVD. Hi, my name's Jimmy Clues and on this DVD I'm going to do two projects for you. One of them's going to be a Ziracorti, a bowl out of Ziracorti, simple bowl, and I'm going to put a brass inlay of powder, it's a brass powder and I'm using a two-part epoxy resin. The second piece is going to be a long stem goblet, um, it's out of an Australian wood called Myrtle. Uh, it's going to be turned unsupported and it's basically show your tool technique and where to leave the support in order to, to get the job done. The first piece I'm going to turn today is, it's a glue up. It's made from wenge and maple and uh, a good friend of mine, Ailey Abbasiwa, gave me it. Uh, Ailey's from Jerusalem and I'm really looking forward to turning this. I've never turned a glue up before, I would like to make a little box. Uh, the second piece is a piece of walnut, it's burr walnut, it's a superb piece of wood, absolutely gorgeous. With that one, I'd like to uh, show you how to put silver rods into the piece, small silver rods, just as a fine detail.